<laughs> I mean, you saw the title, so I guess I don't uh, need to super like preface or build up suspension or anything um, other than say that um, I've been waiting so patiently to be able to share this information with you um, and this exciting news and this wonderful news and I feel like I have been hiding this from you and there's so many rightful uh, reasons why I have and um, and then I was trying to wrap my head around how to make this video and what I wanted this video to look like and should Jeff be here with me? Should it just be me? How, how should this all go down? And ultimately um, we decided that I have spent so much of my life and shared so much of my journey uh, here, just you and I, uh, that this was the right way to do this, uh, just you and I, and for me to sit down and be my vulnerable self um, and tell you all that I am pregnant and that we are having a baby. <laughs> And that I'm so happy and so emotional and uh, overwhelmed with joy and grateful and like every uh, emotion and word uh, in the book. It is uh, such, such a blessing and such a joy and I can't believe I'm finally sharing this with you guys uh, here. Hi, <laughs> welcome back to my channel. <laughs> oh, wow, it has been, it has been, um, a crazy three months since we found out that we are having a baby. Um, and you know, we needed time just the two of us to process this and celebrate this and wrap our heads around this. And, um, and then we wanted to make sure of course that the baby was healthy and growing, um, and everything was on track. And, uh, then we wanted to share with our close friends and family and then like move outward from there. And now that I am officially into my second trimester, we feel pretty confident and comfortable with spreading this wonderful news, uh, to you guys. And, and um, to the internet, which is like such a weird extra layer um, of my life <laughs> that I'm so, so grateful for. And I felt like I was lying to you guys by keeping this such a secret. And I'm sure I was like, I couldn't hold it back. I was definitely like being pretty um, obvious with my clues and my winks and my nods. And I was taking off time left and right because I've just been so exhausted. Um, Luck, I, I, we can go into, there will be plenty to talk about over the next, I guess now I have six more months to go-ish. Um, plenty to talk about and uh, tell you how my first trimester went. Um, but this is all to say, I just feel like so very lucky um, and I'm so grateful to finally share this information with you guys. Uh, so that I can finally like fully be myself here, which is what I've always been on this channel and which I always strive to be. And I just feel like I wasn't able to do that fully with you guys over the last three months. But thank you for sticking around and for understanding. I did my best to provide content that still felt authentic, but uh, certainly I've been holding off um, on this big news and like holding off on like my next try on video because uh my body is starting to look a little bit different and they're just there's just no more um hiding it and i just didn't want to hide it uh, so very excited um lots to say i should have prefaced this by saying but i'll say it now um that i realized just how much people struggle um to get pregnant and how fortunate i am that my body allowed me to do this um especially at my age and and um wow and that jeff bravo jeff <laughs> we we did what we set out to do um fairly quickly and i just am um wanted to make it known that like i am very aware of how many people struggle to get to even this point in the process and um how grateful I am for this opportunity and just, you know, I know how, um, things can change like overnight, but I've just been putting out the good vibes. I've been, I haven't been stressing so much about it. Like I'm just like hippie mama to the maximum capacity and I am just growing 
this child with love and hope and like all the woo woo vibes. So um, there's that. Um, as far as Jeff being here with me today to make this video, we went back and forth and I had this realization that he has to always like remind me of this isn't his like forum. He is not a YouTuber. We are not a family channel. We will never be. He pops in and out of my videos, obviously, because I mean, he is the biggest part of my life. Um, but I, I take for granted my ability and the rest of uh, the YouTubers that I watch uh, here, or, or even those that I don't, successful uh, YouTubers here on YouTube, um, our ability to express ourselves vulnerably and authentically um, in front of the camera. And when it comes to something so monumental like this in our life, where we're still processing um, what this means in like the grand scheme of our life and what a blessing it is, but also the challenges that we will face. I mean, it's just, it, it's such a roller coaster of emotions um, in the best way possible, um, but also with like definitely like ups and downs. And it's so second nature to me to do this and sit down here and have these conversations with you guys um, because I grew up doing this and you and I have this and I'm so grateful for that. Um, but in talking with Jeff about sitting down and doing this, he was really nervous about it because this is not his comfort zone. This is not his forum, like I said, and um, it's not easy for everyone to sit down and be as vulnerable and open. He is a comedian. He is <laughs> the funniest dude I know, uh, a whippersnapper. And like, so he was really nervous about being able to really have this conversation the way that you and I, you and I, you know what I'm saying? Have it. Um, with that being said, uh, first and foremost, he has just been the most wonderful partner in this journey. Like, the minute we found out is like dad mode, husband mode, like activated. He has always had his husband mode, but like even to the umph degree, like the switch was on and he has been, um, so accommodating and, and kind and, um, he's studying the, what's going on in my body at each step of the way. And he's been with me at all of my doctor's appointments and um he's just a fantastic man and i just feel so grateful and i'm so excited to be raising this child with him and he's just going to be the best dad of all times um but we did sit down for a moment last night in a lighter version of this a less i was gonna say glossy but look at look at me a far less a uh, glossy version of this right here last night and I'll show you a little bit of uh, what he had to say in his sweet hysterical uh, Jeff way. But yeah, we're gonna be parents. We are gonna be parents. Uh, I'm gonna be a dad. You're gonna be a mom. We're gonna have a baby. Yeah, we've been like processing this and talking with our friends and family for the last three-ish months. Yeah, we have. How does it feel to like now have this conversation on the world wide web. It's weird, huh? Uh, I often feel like Oscar nominated movie. Everything, everywhere, all at once. With my feelings. All at once. Everywhere. I mean, yeah. <laughs> all over the place. It is a, it has been a, like a, it's such a big thing to process, but ultimately it's the best thing in the whole world. Oh, uh, it's true. Your, your genes click in and like, I'm already happy about it. I'm already excited. I'm already going through grocery stores looking at baby food and <laughs> yelling at bad parents I see on the road, having no idea how to do it myself. It well, all just it activates. It's thousands of years of generational dadness. The powers of dad's past have channeled into me now, as the powers of mom's past channel into you. Yeah. Highlander, a movie that I will show my child. You have been such a supportive partner in this. Thank you. And, uh... You've been amazing. She's been utterly amazing. Uh, the most amazing thing you did, quit drinking like that. You got I'm in awe of it. I'm in awe of it. Uh, you have been taking care of yourself. You have been uh, educating yourself. You have been taking care of yourself physically. Uh, and you haven't drank. 
that I know of. <laughs> there might be some stuff I love happening. that that's like the biggest accomplishment. I leave in the morning and I have no idea if you're just like hammered all day. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. Uh, but I am in awe of you and all the things you can do with your brain and your womb. She has a womb. There's a womb going on. Oh my god, it's so crazy. Jeff, like, we like follow this like app that like tells us everything that's going on and you always like fill me in on more things because you dive even deeper oh i'm a science guy so i'm like all excited about the size of the placenta and whatnot we went and well more stories to come but like we we've seen the baby twice we have seen the baby i saw the baby moving around uh -huh. the baby kicked the baby leg out mm -hmm. um i and saw we will, the baby rolled the baby rolled the around baby rolled, and we will reveal the gender soon Ironic, isn't it? I'm not having a gender reveal party and that's that. But for you guys, we'll figure out some sort of fun way to... I did get this whole balloon that I was going to explode, but it went off course and it caused a lot of trouble. You <laughs> may have seen it in the news. Timely, this guy. Um, all right, well, thank you for doing this with me and for having a baby. Thank you for doing this with you or thank you for doing this with you? Both of them. Uh, and thank you guys for being supportive and lovely. And uh, it's your baby too. It's our baby. No, so no. Please no. <laughs> donate to all the funds below to help me raise a baby. I mean, yeah, we could put our diaper fund down. <laughs> That's right. Send me diapers, used ones. We'll clean them off. We'll put them right to work. Uh, love you guys. Now back to other me, who has makeup on because Lord knows, good God. This Time is for me to go uh, curse while I put the Christmas lights up and mow the lawn. Settling in. Dad life. That's right. All right. So there you go. Afterwards, Jeff was like, I don't feel like I expressed myself properly. And I was like, you expressed yourself exactly as you were supposed to. This is, again, such an interesting job. And I, it feels like more of, more of like a lifestyle than a job to me at this point. This is just my life. So... Thank you for giving me this space to share and for all your support um, as I continue on this journey of my life and um, for caring and like going on this journey with me. I mean, some of you have been with me, you know, the whole, what are we going into, 13 years um, and <sighs> emotional. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed by the generosity of your heart and your time um, and your energy and your thoughtful comments um, and your commitment to supporting me. So here we go. We're having a baby. Um, they're due in the summer and um, this journey just awaits us and I'm totally in it 100% strapped in and ready to just like ride it whatever it looks like um jeff and i are committed to doing it together and to um you know facing anything that might come our way the good the bad and hopefully not the ugly although last night that look on me whew, i was pushing the ugly <laughs> Um, more to come i would love to do a q a uh i'll do a folding story time maybe sort of filling you in on my first trimester if you have any specific questions or like categories of subjects you want me to talk about now that the cat is totally out of the bag let me know we'll do some sort of a fun gender reveal that isn't a full gender reveal because if you read my book or know me at all i will never do a gender reveal but like may as well do something fun here on youtube um and we will just go from there so Thank you, thank you, thank you for all your love, all your support, and all your good vibes. I, I know, uh, people are like, I already like feel in my real life, and I was warned about this, everyone has something to say. A lot of it comes from a good place, um, advice, etc. I, I totally get that, I welcome that, but I also don't necessarily need that. We have wonderful doctors and a community around us who we are consulting every step of the way. I feel very passionate and confident with the choices that we are making. So I ask you to be gentle with your judgments. We are approaching this the best we can. We are taking the precautions and um, yeah, we feel confident in our choices. So uh, thank you for giving me the space to do that uh, alongside my husband. So. 
there you go. I hope I said everything that I wanted to say and I'm there's so much more to say, so much more to feel and so much more to share. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you guys and I will see you tomorrow for a whole new journey. Oh, and by the way, like I will still continue to do a lot of my similar old content like I'm this won't be a fully like maternity channel um, or pregnancy channel I just like again really pride myself on being authentic and sharing like my true self and my true um you know hobbies and like things that are happening to me in the moment and this is the hugest thing that is happening to me uh at this moment and for the rest of my life so um here we go. A whole new chapter uh, is awaiting us. So, heck yeah. <laughs> All right, see you tomorrow.